back with more of the quarry. I wanna, I wanna play this game some more. I know what's going on. Cause like I thought that one character was dead. Okay, I don't know. I can't do it now. But I thought those two characters were <clears throat> dead. Turns out they're not. Just being held captive by the sheriff. Sheriff ain't dead, I believe. I think I spared him. So that's that's nice, like, I guess. And then I took a peek at some of the achievements. Yeah, they were. <clears throat> there is so much. Like I could also easily go back and replay the game a few times, and I'll like 100% it. So, like there's one I can end off pretty quickly by chapter. I want to say eight. Yeah, maybe like chapter eight or something. I could end one of the games for them, but uh, get back into it. <clears throat> Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. <clears throat> I feel like he would be very uncertain right now. Uh, Caitlin, what do I do? Oh, wow, real strong showing on the leadership front. I said shut up. <sighs> oh, no way, I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. Look, just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. Hold up, you, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? What do you know? It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? This isn't a ghost story, it's a creature feature. It's really happening and you're all in it. Your bracelet. What are you doing? I'm trying to help. That's very vague. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. But what if it's Nick <clears throat> or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Ryan, put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. So, come on, where does Chris Hackett live, when he's not at camp, I mean? What makes you think I know that? Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? <clears throat> he's not in the storm shelter, I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods, I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Dude! What? Yeah, there's like no other way to do this. <clears throat> Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? Don't forget about Nick, dude. Okay, any closer we're gonna have to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. 
I'm going with you. What? what? Uh, yeah, what they said. I'm gonna show you that Chris Hackett has nothing to do with this. He wanted us to stay inside tonight. He wanted us safe. I don't care what you think. I wonder why. I don't care what you <clears throat> think. Shut up. Fine. Do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole. Where is it? Ditched in the lake. Why? It was a stolen cop car. You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan. Get somewhere safe. How long do you have? An hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. <clears throat> now we're playing as Laura. Are you sure this is the right way? Pretty sure, yeah. Pretty or definitely? What do I look like, a tour guide? This doesn't feel right. <clears throat> I think you're up to something. I'm not. You better not just be running out the clock. I'm not. The longer we're out here, the longer we're in danger. Said the murderer. You know, it might and be a lot run. more pleasant if you lighten up a little. What is wrong with you? He really did. I've had kind of a fucked up summer. Yeah, well, doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Oh, what's that supposed to mean? I don't know. I, you're still alive, I guess. Nobody else needs to get hurt. An eye for an eye makes the whole world blind. No offense. I'm not doing this for revenge. I need to save Max. You're doing all of this for a boy? I'm doing this because it's the right thing to do. Like I said, kind of a fucked up summer. One of those only one the moves out type things. <clears throat> That completely out, because that right there should have changed if that's the case. There it is. Hack your house. So he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there. But if we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? That's a really good question. Maybe we just don't. Ryan is making no sense right now. Stan, Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell you. Sure. Yeah. Laura, Chris is a good man. This isn't about good and evil, Ryan. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. No, there's another Where way you killed going? a head guy, but... There's a timer, remember? There must be another way across somewhere. No matter what I got you! Careful, it's gonna go! Oh! Oh, fuck, there's water. <clears throat> Holy shit! Are you okay? Laura? Stalks her breath, but shuns clear water. 
Oh my god, Laura. Jesus, Mary and Jazz hands. Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax. Look. Oh damn. What big eyes you have, Grandma? <laughs> no shit. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Define yellow? Shit. We haven't got much time. Okay, so that's cool. It essentially gives you superhuman healing. Because that eye got completely fucked and it's now able to be completely repaired. These must have been from the quarry days. No duh. No one's been down here for years. Are you sure about that? Is that a... How off in the distance really says otherwise. <clears throat> Did you hear that too? It's her. Who? The hag of Hackett's quarry. It's like she's warning us off. Or guiding us. Shouldn't you be saying. Okay. You know, I'm not. This is a quote unquote horror movie game, so I'm not gonna question it. You know, the oh, characters shit. don't have brains. <clears throat> Think anyone heard that? No, they can't have done. This place is not up to code. I mean, if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Let's just keep moving. Yeah. See, he should not be ahead of me. Careful. Jeez. I don't... Okay, my character just decided to push him. At least I can actually see everything Just too. Look at this place. out <laughs> look who's finding their funny bone so what's your deal then what do you mean the whole mysterious brooding loner thing it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe so I don't fit into the right box is that what you're saying yes You know that's not what I mean. I've been coming here for years. You get to know a place and it feels like a second home, you know? I mean, until now. What about your friend, uh, Caitlin? Is that her name? It seems like she looks up to you. Yeah, she... she has the hots for me. Dylan does too. Oh, modesty. Thy name is Ryan. I'm not being smug about it. It's just a fact. I'm not exactly secretive about it. 
So what about you? Who do you like more? I don't know. Maybe neither. You know, she's like that. <clears throat> I see a light. Fuck. Yeah. She's that one uh, standard character that or comes with the toys the end of the Up to you. You know, like the movie or the game that is. Damn. Someone's been eating their spinach. So, <laughs> you want to like go that. into the collapsing joke. nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? Well, you have the shotgun, you go in first, damn it. I hate how the, uh... Yeah, when it, the screen kind of changes, the character's movement does as well. It's like a stuck. It's promising. Splinters. I don't. I'm gonna bother her anymore. <clears throat> Guess we found the party. Alcohol. On prohibition. These are run running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Probably still good. Good. Try vintage. Well, I guess the hackets were bootleggers. That makes sense. I guess when the quarry shut down, they branched out. Come on, time travel later. Well, if that's the case, <clears throat> fucking I. Realistically, how old are they? You think this is it? Uh, beach me. I'm pretty much completely lost. Yeah, me too. Shall we? Okay, I'm gonna play with somebody else now. Caitlin. Infinite ammo. Uh, what the hell happened here? <clears throat> uh, that's kind of my bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin? This place is wrecked. <laughs> well, you should see the other guy. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Probably nothing. Hopefully. I mean, I mean, should we go find them? Warn them? I think the safest thing, the most responsible thing, is to try and get help. Right. Yeah, we haven't... No, we, we don't know what's going on with Emma, but we know Jacob's been captured. And Nick. And Nick. background right now. The, I can't think of her. Oh yeah, right, that is where Emma is. Hold on. No, not that. Abigail. She ran like Velma and Scooby-Doo. What is it? I... Jacob? Emma? Are they... Should I open it up? Your funeral, buddy. You wanna try to scare me, is she? Ah! Oh, she missed me! <laughs> <laughs> 
Or... Chase me! Hey, ah! hey, it's us! Oh, oh shit. It burns. Oh, my God. Oh. I, he wait, is just getting I'm so fucked. sorry. Dylan, I am so, so sorry. Oh, I didn't know it was you. I was really Dylan. scared, and I thought it's not Mace. What? Air freshener. <laughs> oh. Yeah. It's all I could find in the van. I mean, at least he smells fresh. Uh, Dylan, <laughs> you're, uh... So she was in the police station this whole time? <clears throat> Insane, right? This whole time, we were having such a fun summer. We never knew. Jeez. Okay, so the engine's completely screwed. More great news. I mean, if I could summon a working car out of thin air, I would. Wait, maybe I can. Okay, she's gone nuts. There's a scrapyard up the road. If we're looking for a vehicle, maybe there's one there? That sounds like a yeah, long shot. Yeah, point. You'd be surprised on how, uh... Dylan, come on. I need you. How often you're gonna find actual working cars in a scrapyard? Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. Because, like, where I live... What exactly are we, we supposed a... to do? I mean, the van is nice, but it's not exactly Fort Knox. Well, there's a shelter under the lodge. You could be safe there for a while. All right. Abby, you're with me. Good luck. Uh, yeah, because where I live, in that area there, it, uh, well, here in California, I don't know about any other states, the cars, when they like, get into a little fender bender and they're like, uh, they get hit with that DUI equivalent where they can no longer be driven on the road unless you physically fix it and then have to go to a scrapyard, those still run. <clears throat> it's a very brief explanation because every time I try to talk, these characters start talking. What was that? Huh? Oh, what was that? Oh, it's nothing. We got we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. Keep it down. You keep it down. Shh. And now I'm Ryan. I got a couple of this chapter. Fuck. Oh, this is where we need to, we should go in here. Careful. Okay. Being quiet, if you gotta shoot it. <clears throat> Jacob. Hey, it's Ryan. Jesus, what happened to you? Not a good idea because I'm pretty sure this thing is electrified. Hey. Bad idea. Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that.
are you here, Travis? Oh, okay, so he's out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Ma. Uh. <clears throat> it's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got a screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. No. God damn. No. No, no. No, no. Not my granddaughter. Not my only granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit! Not my little Kaylee! <clears throat> God damn you! You're what the did you do to her? Or in a motion capture, I guess? Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? Wait! It's him! Think about it. Why would they lock him in a cage? And who the hell is it? Who the hell is she? She's in charge. You've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Your friend? Hey, listen. Okay. They said that they've already got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're, they're not going anywhere. Remember? We've got to be sure. You promise. <laughs> Fine. Fine. You gotta get me out of here. Be seriously, man. <laughs> They took it! You fucking idiot! Ma. God damn it! You fucking piece of shit! Get away! Get away from me! She mad. Okay, 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 <clears throat> talk me through it. Okay, so, all I know is you have to open my door and that door. And definitely not that door. Oh, cool, thanks, Detective. Okay, fuck you, man, I'm trying to help. No, fuck you, I'm trying to Shut help. Shut up! Shut up! Okay, there's a console on the wall over there, like a box or whatever. You should be able to use those switches to isolate each cage. Okay, hang tight. Okay. Okay, so there's numbers, simple enough. But you want to turn off five. Oh no, th th four and three. Crap, can I, I can't look and see. Okay, how do I select? Wait, how do I? Okay, that's. Let me just turn them all off. Oh. This is way too dangerous. Yeah, because you're fucked. Oh. Okay. Done though. Oh, wait, I'm sorry, dude, please. You're better off down here. What? I'm sorry, man. No, 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 no. dude, come we'll, on. We'll come back for you. Shut the fuck you out, Ryan. Please, Ryan, please do it. Okay? You don't know what they'll do to me. Come on. You gotta let me out. You can't let me down here. Try to help on them, but you know, they don't let you go back and look at it. God, not, not my only granddaughter. Not my Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. <clears throat> so, 
You... You had those motherfucking counselors in your goddamn jail for two whole motherfucking months, right? And you are telling me now that instead of putting a bullet into each one of their little sorry shit-stained brains, you you gave them your silver bullet gun and they shot my Kaylee with it? Is that what you are telling me now, Travis? No more blood on your hands. That's what you, you, you said it. Oh my god, we are way past that now. <gasps> Ma, what, what if it had been me or, or, or Bobby? What then? She was your family. A good boy protects his family. You ain't no good boy. Any other Leo Tim working with us? She could take it all back. I wish I could take it all back, but I can't. Well, I just don't... I, I don't understand why you, you... You couldn't have just taken care of the problem when you had the chance. Taking care of the problem? Do you hear yourself? Yes, I hear my goddamn self if I may be old, but I ain't deaf! I'm a police officer! Oh, so now I'm blind, you motherfucker! Now I'm blind. Oh, you just flashing that badge around like it's worth a million dollars. The only reason you got it is because Hank got killed in a gypsy fire! Ma. Don't ma. Don't ma me. Do you sit down, please? Don't you tell me what to do. Please. And don't you go around. Don't you go around like you better than everybody else, because you ain't. Would you please sit down? Don't you tell me what to do, you piece of shit. Yes. Send Bobby down. Oh, and the chapter. Welcome back. Did you miss me? Hopefully, you've brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? I got two this time. <clears throat> the Wheel of Fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle-eyed can tell where it's going to stop. Okay, well, that was kind of self-explanatory. <clears throat> the Emperor. Authority, paternity, strictures designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall, and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Okay, Let so that one's going to involve the hackers. Details. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. Yeah, so the Emperor, I'm assuming, is what the hack is. Wheel of Fortune is just... Look, okay, Emperor, I want to see if I'm correct. <clears throat> Go. That's the Sheriff. Got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. I think that's the Sheriff. 
Or in that case, was the sheriff. Have you been there before? The scrapyard? Nah. 